Hi, we are looking uh, an ideal school. See, like this should be their U shape uh, schools with the ground in the uh, center. So, with the trees are there. And uh, see, one side opening for students to come and gather for here. Corridors are there, nice. And uh, staff room. Staff rooms are there. And uh, you can go to the staff room and see for cupboards for student for uh, teachers to keep their uh, books and files and here uh, to a hand wash after using chalk piece like that and uh, so fully ventilated airy staff room similarly for uh, toilets also you can see uh, staff room staff for staff toilets different separate and for girls separate toilets boys separate toilets and corridors even classrooms also fully ventilated airy classrooms and if you like this uh, free students also learn better otherwise if they are kept there like in the matchbox how the sticks are kept if the students psychologically also they get weakness and so the toilets also for staff room and for the students are uh, separate separate it should be there like this and in the classroom also you can see very nice and see that four fans are there and in classroom also nice furniture and here cupboards are there to keep books all here because students uh, should not be allowed to carry heavy loads on their back and in the classroom two doors are there so here and there if any emergency two doors they can use and they can save because sometimes uh, some uh, uh, any emergency cases that they can go so like this windows are nice and see that curtains there and all nice so like this board, a white board or the green board, whatever that we use and chalk piece dusters are holders also there and dust bin should be there right in classroom. So these are the ideal classroom and corridors, ground, trees and greenery and uh, see even outside. Uh, as to be inside there and for parents and teachers if anybody come they can sit here in corridors and wait for their kids and notice boards are there we call soft boards and we can uh, paste any notice or information anything need for students and parents here actually water purified waters were kept now because of corona this water uh, um, arrangements not there right so we can see so everything we can understand so how the toilets they are neatly kept so this like is there and we can see this a stage also for students prayer ground the trees and stages stage there so like this a school should uh, have laboratories and we have the here in the school we have labs also so we can see that so where we read uh, a place that should be very nice good and it should provide that all facilities to improve the interest among students not only subject and labs also there so chemistry lab I like that physics lab can say many things physical lab uh, physics labs botany lab geology lab like that all there 
right so i hope you understood what that ideal school need not only physical lab computer labs chemistry lab and botany zoology hostel facilities there hostel buildings there and for public waiting place parking place all should be there so school that should be very very safe and protective encourageable and see that students should feel very happy there to come to school right also many things there to describe a an, an ideal school so i hope a little bit we understood school means not simply buildings and classrooms also they need all facilities right students they are more than our own children we should feel like that then only students will come to be well today's children are tomorrow citizen simply saying not we must show them right in real so auditoriums and uh, visual uh, that's why uh, auditoriums and small classrooms all should be there everything there here in this school mangal vidyalaya petamita chittur district thank you